What's good, everybody? It's your girl, Cherry, and welcome back to Life of Cherry. Hi, you guys. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. If this is the first time hearing my voice and seeing my hands, hi, guys. My name is Cherry, and over here on this channel, we're all about money, business, and motivation. So if you want to see cash stuffings, if you want to see behind the business or behind the scenes of a small business, rather, okay, and if you just need a uh, budgeting best friend a savings challenge friend whatever the case may be you guys that is me so be sure to hit that subscribe button turn on your post notifications and of course because it's free and it doesn't cost you a thing give this video a big thumbs up okay happy february you guys i'm so excited to be back on track to be back to my cash stuffings and so on for it i know i know your girl is late your girl is late but a lot of things have been going on behind the scenes with me, you guys. And, you know, it's really been taking up my time and attention aside from my business. Yes, your girl has a small business on Etsy called Life of Cherry where I sell all of your budgeting wants and needs. Okay, boo? So aside from my business doing so well and taking over my life, I have had a lot of other things going on behind the scenes. Um, I'm the type of person, I don't like to talk about stuff when I'm in it. I'll talk about it when I get through it so you can hear my testimony and you can know that there is a light at the end of the tunnel. As you can hear, you guys, nothing has changed over here. Sirens are still going off every second. Happy Valentine's Day, you guys. Let me know what you guys have planned for you and your boo this Valentine's Day. Am I single? Am I taken? Nah. Your girl just hungry. Feed me. Feed me. And I would love you for life. All right, you guys. Oh, and before we get started, I do have a band-aid here on my finger. I'm so sorry and I apologize because I know it looks kind of tacky, but I accidentally cut myself while I was chopping up an onion. Like, for all my cash stuffers, my YouTubers out there, when you have cut to a whatever on your fingers what do you do what do you do because i don't think i've ever seen anybody cash stuff with no band-aid well boo here it is i didn't want to come on here with my cut exposed so it is what it is all right you guys so this today i am doing my one thousand dollar starter emergency fund cash stuffing um this is where the money is at but let me show you the actual challenge here you guys this is my savings challenge binder inside of this binder there is 12 challenges with two to three variations for each challenge let me just check and make sure okay that the glare from the light is just not let me open can y'all see all right perfect so inside of this savings challenge binder you guys you can save over ten thousand dollars there is an importance of saving, meet the creator, rules to the challenges. All of this is included in the book, you guys. And then you get started right on the challenges. So I will be doing my $1,000 starter emergency fund challenge, you guys. And the reason I'm going to do this, I know in previous videos, I said, mm, this year I don't think I'm going to do it. It's because my emergency fund has taken hit after hit after hit after hit. And it is now time for me to build it back up. So this is a $1,000 starter emergency fund, you guys. Because realistically, when we have our big boy and girl, you know, underwears on, a real emergency can wipe out that $1,000 like in a drop of a dime instantly. So this is a starter. So it gives you like a bottom line, a point to start at and something to build up towards. But in no way, shape or form should $1,000 be what you have in your emergency fund and that's it. So for me, I'm going to do this to reach $1,000 and then I will do one of the variations. Each challenge comes with two to three variations, you guys. So then I'm going to do one of the variations. Where are we with the um, $1,000 starter emergency fund savings challenge to switch it up try writing each number on a page place the numbers into a jar and randomly choose which number you will save every week or you can double the amount that you're saving every week and so on for it so for now i'm just going to go through and let's let's save this money honey i know i told you guys that i will be doing every single challenge in this binder with you guys so it starts here if you have your savings challenge binder and you are doing your thousand dollar emergency fund let me know how much you have saved so far if you don't have your binder boo it's not too late to order it check out the link in my description box or you can just order um 
one of these pages you guys versus the whole binder is an instant download you can just order this one and print it out at home at your own convenience so here's what i'm going to be using before i do this you guys i have to come over to my handy dandy sinking funds binder and i'm going to move this out the way momentarily and what i'm going to do is come over to my emergencies and i have been keeping up and tracking my emergencies you guys by the way these trackers are available in my Etsy shop as well. It is available in six different colors. So get your life. You can get them laminated like I have here, or you can get it cardstock. So on 125, you guys, I did have to take out $90 for something. So now that has my emergency fund with $125 inside. Let me just count it to make sure that that is the correct amount. So we have 110, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Yes. So I have $125 in my emergency fund, you guys. So what I'm going to do, apologies in advance. We're going to be doing a lot of back and forth switching. Okay. I'm going to come back over to my $1,000 emergency fund. And I'm going to get my dry erase markers, you guys. I am using the ultra fine dry erase markers from Expo, you guys. I do not suggest using a permanent marker. It is extremely hard to remove from these pages. By the way, these pages are laminated, which gives you the option to use these pages again and again and again and again, boo, okay? This is one of one, one of a kind. Nobody else has a binder out like this. So I use the Ultra Fine, and I'm going to be using, I don't know, I'll use red today. So the first thing I'm going to do, you guys, is I have $125 already saved. So I'm just going to cross out the dollar amount to equal up to $125. So I'm going to cross out 20, you guys. I'm going to cross out 35, you guys. I'm going to cross out 30, you guys. And I'm going to cross out 40, you guys. And when I add these numbers up, it should be equivalent to $125. And $25. Let me get my calculator. Okay. Your girl a little more organized, so I don't mind getting up. Okay. Here's my calculator, you guys. And by the way, this calculator is available in my Etsy shop as well. So let's punch these numbers. If we have 20 plus 35 plus 30 plus 40. And that gives us 125. So that is accurate, you guys. Oops. So now we have 125 saved up. Today in my $1,000 starter emergency fund, I will be adding, you guys, $25. So this is the 25. I'm going to come back over here to my emergency fund. Pull out my funds. Let me move you over, boo. Actually, let me move this book over. I told you it was going to be a lot of back and forth, boo, a lot of back and forth. All right, so we're going to add this 25 in. And then now in our emergency fund is 120, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. So now we have $150 inside of my emergency fund. And I'm going to update my tracker, you guys. And today is 2 one and I'm adding $30. Oh, no, I added 25, boo. I'm adding $25. And then now I'm going to have $150. And this was a deposit. You could put deposit, add, whatever floats your boat. So now I'm going to put this tracker back inside, you guys. And let's go back over to our savings challenge binder. Now, let me just say... I did have almost a thousand dollars saved up in my emergency um in my emergency fund before you guys. I was very, very down and I felt discouraged when I had to start spending the money. But think of it this way for those of you who have been saving up, for those of you who have sinking funds and now you have to dip into it, now your sinking fund is completely depleted, it's okay. Like it, it's gonna hurt your heart a little bit. It's gonna hurt your heart. I'm not going to lie. Because you're like, dang, all that hard work, or dang, I was so close to reaching a thousand, two thousand, five hundred, however much you're saving. Like that that's going to hurt a little bit, sting a little bit. But think of it this way, you guys. 
at least you had these funds in place even though you have to now use them at least you didn't have to swipe your credit card at least you didn't have to borrow money from this person at least you didn't have to say i'm not paying this bill today because i need to pay that or you know whatever unexpected event came in your life at least you had something set aside for it that's the beauty of having an emergency fund you guys so when i say you know you want to save up more than a thousand dollars let's say if you have an emergency that does cost you a thousand dollars now if you have five thousand dollars saved up boo okay we wiped out a thousand dollars but we still have something in place in case another emergency arises so join me you guys as i am doing my one thousand dollar starter emergency fund and let this be i'm gonna call this the the bottom the bottom line let this be your bare minimum okay to have a thousand dollars is the least amount in my opinion that you should have so um to get back on track i just added 25 dollars to my um, emergency fund so I'm gonna come right here to this $25 mark to just finish off this top row and I'm going to put an X right here on top now guys when you are using this savings challenge binder you can put an X if you want you can I don't know however you want you can color it in if you want you can do like stripes however you choose to fill it out is however you choose to fill it out the beauty of this binder is that once you close the pages okay close rub them together go about your business put your binder wherever you're putting it and then you come back okay it's time to add something else to my challenge then you come back boo boom it's still right here and it did not smear or transfer over to the other page and to wipe it off you simply will get a um let me get it instead of using my fingers you guys okay so you simply will get a um paper towel you guys with a little bit of alcohol and you wipe it off now you don't need alcohol to wipe it off but if you want your page squeaky clean clean looking good as new then use a little bit of alcohol i'll show you over here where's the page at you see i don't know if you can see it's like a little hint of red here and that's because i did not use alcohol but if i want my pages to be squeaky clean like when i first you know received my binder then just use a little bit of alcohol and it will wipe it off completely that is all you guys all right so now what i'm going to do where are you boo my one dollar savings challenge is right here i'm going to update my total save now i have 150 dollars saved in my $1 savings challenge. All right, you guys. So that's going to be it for this video. I'm going to come back. Um, I'm going to try to stuff this challenge twice a month, you guys. And the amounts that I stuff will vary. Like today, I just put $25 in. Next time I stuff it, I might choose two or three numbers. It's just depending on what type of week I'm having financially. It's depending on if it's a pay week or not. It's depending on, you know, if I have extra money. It depends on a lot of factors. But I guarantee you that this will continuously get stuffed because I really want to build back up my emergency fund. And hopefully, in the meantime, in between time, all of these unexpected emergencies are done with and i can actually let this fun grow all right you guys so that is it for now thank you so much for watching this video your girl is back your girl is back let me explain i've been gone for a long time but i am back at it so thank you all for rocking with me those of you who have still been leaving comments thumbs in my videos up asking girl where you at and so on for it you had me here in human form your girl is here okay so turn on those post notifications because i am back on a roll to cash stuffing and all of those good things and i have a lineup for you guys this month like i already have my videos planned out and so on for it so it's, it's about to be a great february okay thank you all for watching don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up turn on those post notifications and of course join the family join the team and hit that subscribe button i will see you all in my next video bye guys